Today we're diving into a new controversy involving former President Donald Trump and his latest claim that has left many scratching their heads. In a radio interview with Hugh Hewitt, Trump stated that he's been to Gaza, despite there being no record of such a visit. So, what's going on here? Trump made this bold claim while discussing Gaza's potential, saying it could be better than Monaco if it were rebuilt the right way. But when pressed for clarification, a spokesperson for Trump's campaign responded that Gaza is in Israel, and Trump has been to Israel. This statement has left many wondering whether Trump genuinely believes Gaza is part of Israel or if it was a deliberate twist of facts. Gaza, as we know, is a Palestinian territory and has been occupied by Israel since 1967. While Israel withdrew settlers in 2005, it still maintains control over Gaza's borders, airspace, and coastline. Trump's comment could either be a blunder of geographic knowledge or something more calculated. Regardless, this comment has reignited discussions about Gaza's political status, the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, and how Trump's previous Middle East policies could factor into his potential 2024 presidential bid. A classic Trump moment where he twists the facts, or is this a simple misunderstanding of Middle Eastern geopolitics? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates hit the bell icon to stay notified of our latest videos.